What is going on guys, it's your boy Raider Knight, and today I'm going to be talking about something a little bit different on the channel. I really want to talk about Two Hollis. Uh, Two Hollis is a artist that's kind of like in the underground. Uh, it used to be more of the hyper pop scene, I'd say. But uh, Two Hollis is one of those artists that I feel like is really like on the come up. And I want to like make a video just talking about his whole discography and just why you should be like clicking in with like what he's doing or whatever. So recently, Two Hollis has been making waves with his new song, Trauma. Uh, he's been touring alongside Ken Carson as an opener. And we've really seen, we've really seen like Two Hollis really like dive into so many different new styles lately that I feel like Two Hollis is definitely like not just a one and done artist. I, I feel like Two Hollis is definitely here to like stay for like the long term or whatever. As for White Tiger, um, it didn't click with me at first when i first listened to it all the way back then because uh, i remember i originally found two hollis just through my spotify recommended it recommended me white tiger and i did listen to it and it didn't really click for me at first the the intro to to white tiger is so loud <laughs> and then and then the the next few songs they still they didn't really click for me Songs like White Tiger, Actor, and Safety were really the highlights on this project for me. Those are the ones that really uh, got me into Two Hollis at first. Granted, I wasn't, I wouldn't say like I was a huge Two Hollis fan with White Tiger. It's like his, his White Tiger is probably like Two Hollis's coolest album art and it was definitely like a cool era for him. But I think my favorite project is probably the one that came after, which is uh, Two. Two came out in 2023. And features a more upbeat pop um kind of like euro pop type vibe to it it's more edm type stuff two two has like no miss in my opinion i feel like two is like my favorite album that uh two hollis has ever dropped songs like poster boy all two god trust i mean there's really like you can keep going on blackbirds is a great song fame runner plaster Really, there's no miss on the on two at all. I would say like it was probably one of the best albums of 2023. That's a hot take. I feel like the production on it is just very experimental. It's very different than a lot of the stuff that was out there before. Obviously, you can make like comparisons to like Starboy and stuff like that. But I feel like, at least in my opinion, I feel like Two Hollis does that sound better. I feel like I'm gonna get a lot of hate on this video. <laughs> I'm just saying I like the music. I don't, I mean, I don't hate uh, Starboy either. Starboy definitely making cool music too. But I do like, I do think Two Hollis does it better. I tend, I tend to say things that I, I, I feel like. And then uh, usually I'll, I'll get attacked for it or whatever. <laughs> but that's just what I, that's just what I feel like, you know. After Two Hollis dropped to the album, uh, he dropped a really cool song called jeans which is probably two hollis's i don't know about his best song but it's probably one of my favorite songs from two hollis and then after that we got light and we got crush and then we got the uh third project from two hollis which was boy and now this album i don't think it's as good as two but i still feel like this album just shows how diverse his sound can be he really switches it up there's a lot more edm in this and there's a lot more just overall like variant of song types, I feel like. I feel like this is his most cohesive project, like in terms of like a proper album. I feel like this is his most, like you can tell it's an album or whatever. I think my favorite uh, song on this project is probably Light, followed by Lie. Lie, I, I listened to that song when it first came out. I probably listened to that song like 80 times in a row. <laughs> that song was really good. And then Three is also a pretty cool song. Really cool production on three. And then after this album is when we got Trauma, which kind of features like a more of a Ken Carson type vibe since he's been touring with him as the opener or whatever. But I just wanted to make this video about Two Hollis, just his whole discography, what songs I like and why you, why you guys should be like tuning in or whatever, because Two Hollis is definitely going to be making some crazy stuff. Whether that be his next project be more like Ken production type or just more two or or boy or or even white. He'd go back to the white tiger sound even. I don't know. 
or maybe it'll be something completely different. Two Hollis has a really cool style and there's really cool vibes around all the music he makes and I just feel like definitely worth checking out. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this little video and I will see you all for the next one. Peace.